Hello everyone and welcome back to the Outer Worlds. We are gonna get a dust back casserole. <laughs> We're gonna take Felix and Parvati with us. Yeah. How are you peeps doing? You doing alright? I'm I'm doing quite peachy myself. <laughs> and the reason I'm so peachy right now is because I just got my very first, well, second Pokemon game in my whole life. The uh, the first Pokemon game I played was Pokemon Snap for the Nintendo 64. And that one, I, I didn't know what I was doing. I was just having fun taking pictures of Pokemon in that game. And it was just mindless entertainment. I like it. Liked it, rather. Well, today I bought three Pokemon games. And uh, editing, if you could share that tweet I sent, that'd be perfect. And uh, I'm gonna be playing them in the either in December or in the New Year, or both. And so you can expect uh, you can expect some nice Pokemon footage. Probably from uh, from Pokemon Sword first, since the Switch is going to be much easier to record. I haven't I haven't really uh, set up the like the holders for my uh, or my brother's Nintendo DS and my phone. Because I found a way online where you could record through your phone. Only I have yet to uh, test it out. So possibly Pokemon Sword is going to be first. Hey, you chef. Whoa, by the stars, my poor heart. I just about pissed my jumpsuit. I'm sorry, buddy. Most people don't. We're used to folks swooning at our feet. You don't gotta be embarrassed. A healthy survival reflex is nothing to be embarrassed about. <laughs> Besides, this place is enough to try anyone's nerves. Uh, why is that? Where should I begin? With the oversized mantisaurs? Or perhaps the rap spewing acid at our walls? <laughs> the board was right. This place isn't fit for human habitation. And I was a fool for staying. Aw, don't do that. People are doing good here. By the by, my engineer is looking to get a dust back casserole. Can you cook one of those? That was a real popular meal 10, 20 years back. Before the board tucked tail and ran. These days, everybody's had a belly full of salt tuna. They all want borst. And the mushrooms, well, not many venture out of town, what with the monsters hereabouts. I can whip one up for you, but it'll cost. Here's a menu. Oh, yikes. I can't cover this much, Captain. <laughs> I get 3,000 bits. Blasty hell. Yeah, sure, I can cover that. You got it. I got all the ingredients. Should only take about an hour in the oven. Sweet. Don't worry, Pavati. There we are. Now, if you don't mind, I really need to take a leak. Go for it, mate. My belly's gurgling just to smell it, Mr. Raymond. Thank you so much. A pleasure to help such a charming young lady. Oh, gosh. My tongue's rumbling just smelling that casserole. Well, let's get back so that you and your, uh, date can eat it and enjoy it. As soon as I get more ammunition. What is that? Level 28. I kind of want to get it. Level 22. Short cannon. Don't I have a shock cannon? Uh, level 12 flamethrower. Uh, flamethrower. No, I don't have a shock cannon. Okay. Alright, what do you think, Pavati? Good enough. The dust back casserole Mr. Raymond made smells incredible. 
Oh, I kind of want to take a little taste. But I'm gonna be strong. Now look how cute these cakes from Cascadia are. Someone even traced little hearts in them. Oh, I guess that settles dinner. Thanks for hauling me all over creation, Captain. You're welcome, lass. Well, I was gonna, but then it hit me. I got this nice meal all planned out with music, and I got that soap to scrub up with, but I don't got nothing nice to wear, Captain. Oh, sure you do. I don't have a head for fashion, and I can't really picture myself in something clean and pretty. There's this place I heard of in Byzantium, Jollikers Haberdashery. I bet I could find something nigh on perfect at a place like that. Alright, we'll go by there. Thanks, Captain. I know I've been asking a lot, but you help me out every time. You're the best. Always. We're gonna make certain this date is perfect. Anything for my little sister, who I liberated from Edgewater by shooting her, her uh, boss in the face. <laughs> All right. Go to Groundbreaker, turn in a few quests, and hopefully we can get to, what is it again? Byzantium? Sounds too fancy for me. I'd much rather live on the unreliable. It's small and cosy. Just enough room for my... Some crew members are causing a disturbance on the ship. Again? You're adjusting before you pull. You're anticipating. You... Of course I'm anticipating it. What if I shoot a friend on accident? That's on account of your stance. You want to lean into it. Oh, you we've already it. seen this. Work with it. Keep you practicing, Parvati. You'll do well. I know it. Ooh, what is this? The Iconoclasts. Now that Zor is in charge, the Iconoclasts have a fighting chance at surviving and spreading from Monarch. Woohoo! Ah, that's the Iconoclasts stuff. Whoa! What better to establish dominance over an alien ecosystem than by hunting its most dangerous predator and mounting its head on your wall? <laughs> CNP Borst Worst Sign. <laughs> Do me proud, and I shall shower you in Borst Worst and gold. Cross me, and I will serve your head on a silver platter with mushroom gravy. Signed by the Borst King of Monarch himself. <laughs> but didn't. Didn't I. D didn't, the, didn't the Borst King. die? I'm so confused. <laughs> Messages for Olaf. What? From J. Jennison. Parvati, I don't do this, ever, so here goes. There's this engine, see, and it hums real nice. Subject po- Oh, poem! Like a box of cats playing with mice, but she's coughing and hacking up sludge, because there's a blockage that just won't budge. What's an engine to do? Then this wrencher strides in like a shark. Hair all done up and fancy and dark. She feels a spasm in her compression alternator, trembling because it's aching to meet her. What's an engine to do? I've got, oh, five more stanzas mapped out, but I'm having trouble rhyming some of the parts. So I'll get back to you on that. Ah, these were the poems. We were talking about old friends, you know, and I got to thinking about Isabel. I don't know what I was thinking. I don't know what she was thinking. We were a mess. A good mess, but a mess. I'm a better me than I was then. Wanted you to know, even when I drink too much of the old family recipe. 
a pretty swell party tea. Damn you, insta spell check. Meet my wrench. Too tired, just gonna put my head down. Oh god. Okay, so those were the uh, the sweet love poems from Junlei. Okay, now we have to go back to the Groundbreaker because we can't get to Byzantium. That honestly sounds like a rare mineral. <coughs> okay, let's go back to the Groundbreaker and turn in that quest. Ooh, we can go to we can go to Eridanos. Oh, we can't. Bagger. So, yeah, let's go back to Groundbreaker. And turn in that quest for Sublight. We've arrived at the Groundbreaker. Woohoo! Alright. Let's go turn in. Um. take you to actually no Pavati you're out yeah okay you're in post west I swear that image is gonna give me nightmares it just looks so wrong and disgusting and yet the boss seems to like it so much Ugh. oh please I wish I could gouge my eyes out. <laughs> Not really, but I, I, I just wish I could get that image out of my head. I wish I have never seen that image. Oh, man. Please don't haunt my nightmares. Or haunt my dreams, rather. Turn my dreams into nightmares. Oh yeah, I can sell a lot of stuff. Sell the flamethrower, shovel, and just pretty much sell everything. Whoa, yeah, got uh, loads to sell here too. of mods. Great. You know, I I should probably just stop buying the ammunition. I don't need all of it. Whoops, wrong one. Fuck her. Right, you know I'm gonna sell all my ammunition. There we go. I'll sell all my energy and ammunition. And I'm gonna equip you. Because why not? So that I can intimidate peeps. Alright, come on you two. Let's see here. Wait, was it? No, it wasn't over there. Was it over... Yeah, it is here. I'm sorry. Am I causing a scene? See, Umfuru? We could have avoided all this unpleasantness if you just let me talk to Jesse in the first place. What's this about? Let me get one thing straight. Jesse and I are not friends. I just owe her, okay? As for the rest, I'm trying to figure that out. All I know is that she's been here too long, and she's apparently not receiving visitors. Hmm, maybe I can look in on Jesse. Be my guest. If you know something I don't about dealing with hospital bureaucracy, I'll be impressed. 
don't know how you managed to get Zora and Sanjar in the same room. Hey, buddy. What seems to be the problem? Oh, no problem, buddy. I'd like to see Jesse Doyle. If only my other patients had so many inquiring after them. I'll tell you what I've told the others. The records say Ms. Doyle checked herself in and requested I admit no visitors. The requests of our patients are paramount, so no, you may not see her. Hmm. I'm one who helped Wanda get her automax. Can't you do me a favor in return? Yes, and we're grateful for the help. I'll let you in, but please do respect Miss Doyle's privacy. Woohoo! Yes, sir. Any chance I could have a look at your back rooms? I'm afraid that area is quarantined for the safety of Groundbreaker. Why do you ask? Oh, I'm just curious. <laughs> I need to calibrate one of Wanda's mechs, and I don't want to get oil everywhere. Very well, you may enter. But please don't linger. I prefer to keep the dangerous pathogens corralled where I can see them. Yes, sir. Okay, that's where Lilia is. Where is... Okay, we'll go talk to Lilia first. And then we can go check out Ellie's friend. Who's not her friend. Who she owes. Come on, you two! Lilia! I'm here. That gas is going to make us a fucking mint. 120 some cubic meters of it at a million bits a pop. Take this. You've earned it. When we get buyers lined up, I'm going to buy a gold toilet to shit in. <laughs> Ooh, persuasion 100. You're not the only one who enjoys the finer things, Lilia. <laughs> the height of ambition for us all. You're goddamn right. Monarch isn't exactly a walk down the lanes of Byzantium. But here you are with all your limbs attached. Call me impressed, contractor. Do you always send your first timers into certain peril? I guess you're just one of the lucky ones. Look on the bright side. You just started, and you're already on the path to a promotion. Woohoo! You've been keeping busy. I hear you took on some extra work at Fallbrook. Catherine says the factory needs some repairs before it's back to working order. But at least it's under our control. Hey, when you were at the slaughterhouse, those swine didn't give you any... strange looks, did they? Maybe... Like they were hanging on to your every word, scheming. And when you turned around, maybe they just point like innocent little idiots. I, t I take it you have some experience with that? <laughs> you talk that way to your last boss? Consider yourself on notice. That attitude has no place in a legitimate business like mine. I'm probably getting worked up over nothing. Just try not to think about pigs. You never know, you know? You doing okay, Lilia? I've got a lot on my mind, but it's nothing that concerns you. At least, not yet. I have another job lined up, assuming you're still interested in work. Yes, gimme. You're gonna salvage me a space station. Heliospheric Research Station 1084, to be exact. I want it. Cobwebs and all. Interested? Yeah! Looking to expand, huh? Fallbrook ain't big enough for you? This opportunity won't come around again, Captain. Yes! Gimme! Gimme, gimme, gimme! Here, this override bypass should get you into the station systems where you can plant my flag. And one last thing. When you get there, make sure you aren't followed. 
We wouldn't want that. We wouldn't want that at all. I'm on the heels of something big. Play your cards right and I'll clue you in. But right now, I'm not sure who I can trust. I'm... Just be careful. Someone might try and use you to get to me. I'm just the peach for the job. <gasps> Level up! <laughs> you look, uh... You looked baked, Nioka. <laughs> And with that, I want to thank everyone for watching. Thank you for, yeah, th thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoy the next video. Where we go to, where is it? Oh yeah, the, uh, the medical bay. We get to tinker around with pathogens. <laughs> Choose. Alright, I leveled up, which means... Wow, my persuade is really bloody high.